The Russian missile strikes that slammed into the Ukrainian capital during the Monday morning rush hour shattered the feeling of relative security that Kyiv has enjoyed since the last missile attack four months ago. Anger and hurt was clear among residents of Kyiv, where police say at least five people have been killed and 12 wounded. Really, I, I think because they are bastards. <laughs> That's it. They want to destroy our people, our infrastructure, everything. I really don't know. And I'm extremely angry, you know, by our kids, our people should, uh, uh, should, should yet, I don't know how what to say. Why? For what? That was Olena Somik who recently fled her hometown of Kherson for Kyiv, hoping it would provide more safety. These are Russia's most widespread airstrikes since the start of the Ukraine war, raining cruise missiles on busy cities, knocking out power and heat, in apparent revenge for the explosion on the bridge connecting Russia to the annexed Crimean Peninsula. Russia charged Ukraine with responsibility for the blast while a Ukrainian presidential aide blamed the incident on infighting between Russian security bodies. In Dnipro, this local said she didn't know why her city had been targeted. <laughs> there is nothing to target here. Damn Putin, let him die. Please shower them with bombs so that these evil people feel what we feel when they kill us and our poor children. <laughs> Drop more bombs on them. Explosions were also reported in at least six other cities around the country. Ukrainian officials said at least 10 people were killed and scores injured and swathes of the country left without power. Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky said Russia timed its attacks to inflict the greatest possible losses, telling the public to remain in air raid shelters, while Kiev Mayor Vitaly Klitschko warned residents to expect further attacks. Thank you.